The world itself is unchanging. We must change to understand it. Its secrets will only be revealed through a careful study of the truth. But we have been taught incorrectly theories by great men who were limited by archaic tools and beliefs. We live in a time of progress. Art, medicine, philosophy. Every day new breakthroughs are made. But when we look to the sky, we do not question. We remain in the past. It is time to remand our schooling, to explore the world as it truly is. My colleagues and I have set up workshops throughout Roma. Please, visit us. We have much to share. Who is this man? He comes from Russia. I hear he studies at the Vaticano, but his words are unlike any that issue from that place. Some may tell you to be content with Ptolemy's explanation of the heavens. His mathematical contortions of the spheres dancing around the Earth. <laughs> but why are such complicated numbers required? Perhaps to disguise a myriad of contradictions? You must question bad logic. It is why we live, to ask questions. Kill him quickly. The Master wants all the scholars silenced by nightfall. The Borgia are involved, and so am I. You are an inspiration to us all. Grazie. <laughs> are you that defends without cause? One who believes in freedom. Ezio Aditore da Firenze. Ezio. They call me Niccolò Copernico. I have heard your name spoken at the Borsha court. But now I have proof that you truly exist. Il Vaticano welcomes you. Yet, you are under attack by its guards. You think me one of them? Truthfully, you would be right. Yesterday, I was a Templar. And today? The Templars wanted me to keep the findings of my experiments hidden. And that I cannot do. The Borgia hunt for you and your friends. My fellow scholars? 
The logic of such a purge escapes me. Find Copernico! But we will discuss reasoning later. Follow me. Follow my lead. the butchers he was thinking of selling All right, this... You will be safe here. What of the other scholars? How do I know I can trust you? How do you know anything? Knowledge gathering is a dangerous enterprise. Easier to stay in place, learning nothing, than to risk in order to truly know. All right. Enlighten me. Take these letters to the scholars. They must be informed of the threat to their safety.
from Copernico. Thank you. Pernico sent me. Grazie.
un poco. The Borgia are after you. Then I will hide. Thank you. Safety. I will. Grazie. Have I done? What a way to strike the bastards. We are not powerful. Caro Leonale asks all residents to please visually ascertain whether or not the street is empty before throwing glass from your Take this. It is from Copernico. Grazie. All letters are delivered. While you were gone, I determined the most likely source of these strange attacks. The master of the sacred palace. Who is that? A Dominican, appointed by the Pope, who ensures that Roman religious philosophy remains pure. He never liked my studies to begin with. Now that I have crossed the Templars, he has clearly retaliated. Where can I find him? Cardinals typically congregate nearby. Follow one of them. The master likes to breed each one. Perhaps you will hear more conclusive evidence.
Reyes was a human of the Black Black Soul, Earth Lover, no doubt. But he was a great I'll have a guard on you, bitch.
There is one good thing come from all this newfound work that I did not expect. With all the running around from Clienti to Negozio to Produttori, I have almost no Any time Any news of Copernico and the others? Nothing. Nothing. Those fools. Inundating the people with their theories. We can barely contain the populace as it is. I have dispatched Can my best guards to deal with them. To I trust they will make quick work of it. I must stop I them. The guild's custom.
You are right. The master intends to kill you. I will not let his bullying stop my research. Tonight there is an eclipse. I intend to chronicle it. But the master hunts for you. Better to die enlightened than to live in ignorance. His end will come much sooner than yours. Silencing the truth will not stop its spread. People are lazy. They will believe what we tell them to believe. I have sent my best man to find Copernico. You are already too late. Requiescat in pace.
The world not marvelous? Some of it. You should not be so emotional. You will find it all makes more sense that way. Perhaps. Cesare thinks himself the center of it all. But he circles the periphery with the rest of us. And did you know that the sun is most likely the midpoint of the universe? Not the earth? I see the movements of the moon and stars, and yet I can only observe. So much is unknown to me. This age of reason is but the beginning of an end I will never see. Someday we will be able to influence this world, to exploit the power of human will, to harness light and perhaps even travel into the heavens. But I am getting ahead of myself. First, we must see the sun spinning at the center. I believe what you say is possible. You should not accept my word. Not until I have proof. Soon. Buonanotte, Ezio. And thank you. <laughs> 